In this video, I will be explaining how you would set up your Dymo Label Writer for Excel in order to print eBay shipping labels. So first, you want to search Dymo Label Writer for Excel software, and for my case, it'd be on Mac. And then you want to click on the first one, and it'll bring you this page. And you want to go down to Product Type, Label Writer, Label Printers. And the model would be Label Writer 4XL and click Find Downloads. Once you get here, you want to click on the Dymo Label Software version 8.6.1 for Mac. And then this will begin to download. Okay, so once this software downloads, you're going to want to click to open it. And then once this opens, you're going to want to double click to open this box. And then click continue, continue again, keep continuing, and then agree to the software. And then install this. It's going to ask for the password to your laptop if you're on a Mac. And once you type that in, click install software, and then continue once more. And then this will be installing the software. It should only take about a minute or so. Once that finishes installing, hit continue once more and I'll let, it, let you know it is installed successfully with that little noise. And you close that. You can close this out. You want to open text edit and you're going to click file, page setup. Then you'll go, um, doesn't matter format for any printer, that's fine. You can do manage custom sizes and then you'll have to click the plus and you can double click and label it shipping label you want to click off of that and you can change the dimensions to 4 by 6 non printable area doesn't matter just make sure this stays 4 by 6 and then uh, margins can all stay 0 click OK and then I like to change the scale to 86 because it makes the whole shipping label show up on the Dymo. And then you can close that out. And you'll want to go into eBay and go up here where it says Printer and Label Receipt Preferences. And you're going to want to make sure this is on Zebra LP2844 slash Z. 4 by 6 inch. You're going to want to save that. And then you come down here, enter in the information for your um, item. And you're going to want to purchase the postage. And you want to go in here, open the label window. You want to make sure that you add the printer Dymo Label Writer 4XL. So add that. And then you can you can use the shipping label that you just made in text edit, and then you should be able to print this, and it'll show up. Everything is on there. The outline of the whole shipping label. And you can just peel that off and put it on your package. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe.